Hi, this is Pastor Aaron here. And uh, this week we want to talk about the word identity. Remember, you recall that we talked about this idea of living the adventurous life, that when we walk with Jesus, uh, there's never a dull moment. But here in this particular passage in Matthew chapter 4, verses 1 through 11, Jesus has been fasting for 40 days and 40 nights. Uh, he's weak and Satan comes to tempt him. The interesting thing is that the scripture says that he is led uh, into the wilderness in desert territory by the Holy Spirit. I think sometimes God uh, tests us and I think Jesus at this point is modeling what it looks like to live in the in-between time of Christ's first coming and his second coming. So he's modeling for us. How do you wait? How do you wait on Jesus coming? So we find here Jesus is being tempted by Satan. And he confronts Satan with scripture. And he tells him, if you are the son of God, command that these stones become bread. And I love what Jesus does here. He says to Satan uh, that man shall not live by bread alone, but by every word that proceeds from the mouth of God. And every time Satan comes to Jesus, he comes back with a biblical rebuttal because that's the only thing that can really push Satan back. But also Satan wants to bring Jesus identity into question. But Jesus knows who he is. He knows that he's the son of God. As a matter of fact, in chapter three of Matthew, God the Father speaks up and said, this is my beloved son in whom I well please. So Jesus is aware of his identity. And I want you to be uh, assured of your identity as well, that you are a son. You are a daughter of God. And there will be times that Satan will bring up your identity and question whether you are a child of God. Be affirmed today that you are a child of God. And next week we're going to talk about rest. So I look forward to seeing you on next week.